Hey folks, welcome to this edition of Straight Talk, the number one YouTube channel for any business owner, aspiring business owner, startup student, or anybody who wants to be successful in this insane world of business and being an entrepreneur. My name is Lou Mosca. I'm the Chief Operating Officer of American Management Services here in beautiful Orlando, Florida. Recently, a Gallup Wells Fargo poll surveyed business owners on six key financial measurements, dimensions, to calculate owner confidence. These six dimensions were revenue, cash flow, capital spending, hiring, credit, and their overall financial situation. Would you believe the poll found that owners are more confident now than they were back in April of this year, but still nearly 60% lower than Q4 of 2019? certainly going to be a slow, arduous process to get back to that degree of confidence. But there are three things you should do to mitigate that. You want to build your business back? Three things. First, smash that like button. Share with friends and family, anyone who you think would benefit from the videos we produce weekly. And don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified when we release a new video on this channel. Separately, on the latest episode of our podcast, the Hardball Profits Way podcast. The link, is, the link is in the description where you could listen to it. We discuss business owner confidence in the new Gallup poll. I've talked about owner confidence in the past, early in 2019 to be exact. What I said then was, so you need to take stock of what's within your four walls, the things you can control, your customer relationships, your vendor relationships, your banking relationships. I still believe in that. But because of COVID-19, everyone is at the bottom or everyone is banging their head against the walls. Here's what every owner should do to increase confidence and take stock of the things you can control. You're not gonna like some of this, but don't be afraid. Number one, if you do great stuff and provide great service, raise your prices. If you're good at what you do, raise your price by 2% isn't unreasonable. Doesn't sound like much, but if you're doing a million dollars a year, That's an extra $20,000 net in your profit. Number two, don't be afraid to change your business model. Require a deposit, a down payment of 25% of the total cost up front if if you're doing business without a deposit. Give notice when this takes effect. Number three, expand who you are and what you do. Don't be afraid to expand your reach. Be more aggressive. If you operate in the state of Georgia, expand to two more states. If you offer service or a product A, think about providing service or product B. Be aggressive and adapt to survive, but more importantly, to thrive. What are you doing to adapt to these crazy times? Leave your answer in the comments below. If you're in the process of adapting and need some assistance, feel free to give me a call 800-743-0410 or visit our website amserv, A-M-S-E-R-V dot com. It's the first link in the description down below. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications. It's great seeing you again. I wish you great success.